Cheers, everybody. Typical English weather. Rains all day, and suddenly in the evening, the sun comes out, the clouds disperse, and spent all day getting soaked. Um, <clears throat> we're off to my neck of the woods with this one. Um, my old neck of the woods. We're off to West Sussex. We're off to Partridge Green. I know Partridge Green very, very well. And we have uh, a beer which kind of stood out for me here on the shelf um, because it's a, a Vake or Vike IPA and it's from Dark Star Brewing Company. I um, haven't done many on this channel for them. And we have a can of their Nordland IPA, super smashing great, clocking in at a mighty um, 5%, a little bit dark, let's put the light on. 5%. So there you go. Um, it says on the, the back, taking its name from one of the best places on earth to view the Northern Lights. Well, I've never seen the Northern Lights in my life. Nordland IPA is a tropical delight with distinctly Nordic twist, notes of orange citrus. I'm not going to go into that. Um, Norwegian farmhouse's Vake Voss. It's got in this. Um, it's not saying anything else. But best thing to do is crack it open. See what we get. Like you do. Yeah. Yeasty tropical note there. Straight away. Smells half decent. So let's pour it out. A little bit lively. <laughs> A little bit lively. <laughs> it, you know, it doesn't help me just throwing the can about, does it? boys and girls it doesn't as you can see yeah look at that look at that let's say bloody calm down shall we as you can see boys and girls i absolutely screwed that up too busy talking not concentrating on the poor as usual as you can see uh that's the color of the beer um a bit murky um that head's not gonna go anywhere so I'm going to have to go uh, frothy head diving. Frothy head diving. That's what we're going to do. So I'm going to say cheers to you. Cheers to you. And I'm going to go in. Cheers. Mm. Once I go for that layer of froth, um, you do get to the beer, funnily enough. Um, it's You pick up the tropical notes straight away. Um, I've, I've got a little bit of a problem do, of this tropical feel in this beer. Like a, The tropical notes just feel a little bit... Purified, as in puree, um, for me. Um, I'll go in again in a minute. I'll let it settle, to be honest. it's uh, I've always had this problem with tropical beers. They're not really... I, 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 I drink them because, you know, it's for the channel. But um, out of personal choice, I, I don't really levitate or gravitate towards them if you know what i mean um again again cheers mm. straight away bitterness and it does feel a little bit different now now i've had a proper gulp of it you do pick up um a, a mishmash of tropical fruits for me. There's no real um, tropical fruit taste that stands out in this beer. It's very mashed up together. Um, do I, you know, recognise that yeast? What, you know, they're going on about in this. It is a slight yeasty presence, to be honest, in this. There is... More presence in this and in other IPAs I've had of, of yeast. You, you you pick it up. Um, but does it work? 
does it work to a degree i suppose it does work um still not my favorite style tropical beers it's just I just i just don't do it for me but um where does it stand um i mean it's pleasant enough i wouldn't buy it again to be honest i've tried it once i've tried it now and it's one of them to just forget about um for me it's not really a beer which resonates for me it's the more i drink it the more dryness starts to come through and the more them tropical notes subside they kind of like fall back on themselves in a way for me and I mean I'm not jumping around with excitement about it am I I'm just not I'm just it's just not doing it for me to be honest <laughs> so you want to know I'm not going to waffle one more you want to know do I think this beer is any good this beer is okay it's okay that's it it's just okay it's, would I buy it again no because there's lots of just okay beers out there for me and for me this one doesn't really get me excited and gets me jumping up and down with excitement saying to you boys and girls out there go this beer is superb go out and buy it now <laughs> so boys and girls um all i'm gonna say all i'm gonna say is it's not pretty it tastes okay Go out, try it for yourselves. Tell me what you think. Tell me if I've got it wrong or whatever. You know, your um, opinion is warranted in my world. And thank you very much for watching this beer review and see all of you on another one. Cheers.